All right, kids. Today, what you're going to do is you are going to begin making Sailor Sam. Um, Sailor Sam is going to be the captain of your wind car, okay? So we are going to make Sailor Sam so that he can ride on your wind car, all right? And we'll figure that out when the time comes. I want to go over a couple things right now. Um, at this point, you should have taken your coordinates and your coordinate plane, and you should have designed Sailor Sam. He should be flat on paper, ready to cut out, okay? So if he's on your coordinate plane and ready to cut out, this is what he looks like, okay? Notice that, you know, his head and his body are in quadrant one, parts of his torso are in quadrant two and quadrant three, his legs and feet are primarily in quadrant four, okay? Now, take if, if you're looking at what you drew and it doesn't look like this, you're going to want to pause the video and go back and correct any mistakes that you've made. Because if you did everything right on the page, and I think everything was right on the page, it should look like this. If it doesn't look like this exactly, then go back and make the changes you need to. Okay, Because I'll be the first to admit that um, this has been edited two or three times by me, but still, things sneak by. Um, but anyways, um, so if your Sailor Sam looks like this, you're ready to cut it out, okay? When you cut out Sailor Sam, you're going to cut out the perimeter, okay, of all the shapes that you've put together, okay? So each of these was individual, let me grab the page, okay? So each of these, like for example, this is the head, the head was made from these points, simply drawing one section like that, stopping, and then doing the body. The body was made from these points, so it went like this. Now what I did was I outlined where you'll be cutting. So wherever I have blue, that is where you will cut out Sailor Sam, okay? And so you can see how maybe his arms will fold into a triangular prism. Um, his legs will fold into triangular prisms, okay? See, that's, how, that's why his legs and arms look the way they do, because these will fold into triangular prisms, okay? So anyways, um, these are the torso parts of his body, and they will get glued on separately, all right? And so what you're going to do now is if your drawing looks like this and you have all the fold lines in place, and what I would do is I would outline what it is you're going to cut in a certain color. Get a colored pencil, maybe get a marker, uh, whatever you want to do. But I would outline everywhere you're going to cut in a specific color. Then I'd go back and then I would make sure that I've drawn in any lines that I need. You can come back to this video at any point and take a look at this drawing and make sure you got things right. Uh, but anyways, when you cut out Sailor Sam, let me show you a little something. I'm going to grab some scissors real quick. Thought I had some scissors, but they're being used to prop up my camera. When you cut out Sailor Sam, okay, you're going to cut right along those blue lines. Now notice how I don't try to turn a corner. I'm just going to come back in like this and cut down that blue line. Then I'm gonna turn it and I'm gonna cut it like that. Okay, that way I don't have to turn any corners. Now I can take this, I can make one snip right up to the blue line, right in there like that. Now, rather than try and get in here and make this turn with your scissors, I'm just gonna come in like this, snip, right up to the corner there and then I can just simply snip that off like so okay so now I'm ready to cut in like that if I need to so now I'm just gonna come over here and now this creates a lot of waste but it is much faster and you don't risk damaging 
Sailor Sam. So I just come over there. Now this part gets tricky getting in there. There's almost no real easy way to get in there. But I'm going to cut right up to the corner. I'm going to spin. Cut right up into the corner. And then I'm going to go in along the angle. Like that. Okay. And then I can cut this off over here. Like so. I can come in like this. And this is how we cut metal and stuff like that when we're out building houses and we're putting solvent and fascia up. This is how I learned the easiest way to cut metal because you can't turn your you can't turn metal cutting shears easily. So you come in wherever your parts are, and then you can just snip it like that. Okay, and then here's his side of his head. Okay, so anyways, it gives you an idea of what Sailor Sam will look like as you start to cut them out. These can then be folded into a triangular prism to make his arms, okay? And so I will show you another video for uh, sh gluing them up and that sort of thing. But for now, that's how you're gonna wanna get them cut out. Once Sailor Sam is cut out, this is what he will look like, okay? Or she, because it could be Samantha. We don't know. But this is what your Sailor Sam should look like. Once cut out, you will have all your parts in front of you. Okay? You then can color in his face. And you can turn him over because the non-line sides of the arms and the legs will be what shows up front. So you can then color in his pants and his... Uh, shirt and his sleeves and all that okay uh, these are the parts that go and form the triangular pyramid body again you can color these so that they match up like this and so whatever you color the pants you can color on the front there make everything match up okay this is the other side if you fold it and these get glued together like this you can see how they're going to form up, uh, not real good right there, but you can kind of see how those are going to form his body, okay? So anyways, this is what you want to do. You want to go from your drawing on the coordinate plane, cutting it out, and then coloring it, okay? And then I'll give you another video that shows you, video that shows you how to glue it together. If you have questions, come see me. If you've made a mistake in your drawing, and I have extra coordinate planes, printed. You can have one if I have extras. All right. Good luck with Sailor Sam.